is basically informal. 60 to 70 percent of its urban areas are informal areas. And that's why we um, try to focus our project in, an, in a typical informal area in Cairo. Uh, we've done some surveys, um, introduced the idea of what is an eco-citizen, what is an eco-city, uh, what can be done, what are the measurements we are doing. Because you know, a lot of people say we want to become an eco city, we want a greener city, but what is a greener city? How can you actually measure a greener city? How can you measure an eco city? We try to engage the students. We have a group of students uh, during one of our courses, our, it is called community development. And we were fortunate to have some previous work in this area and uh, some ties with uh, some community-based organizations here. They've been very helpful to introduce us to the local community. We went into the community. We divided into three groups. A group was um, dedicated to uh, do the eco-citizen surveys. They asked the people questions about how eco-citizen they are, or whether they have accessibility to services, to water, to food, what is the quality, the affordability of such services, the proximity to health and recreational services. The second group was um, responsible of going into into units and uh, collecting data with about the parcels, the parcel audits. The third team was uh, responsible for gathering samples for our water uh, measurements and uh, along with the air measurements and of course they were using uh, GPS equipment to specify the location for each measurement. display nice um, inter display in the area we like set up a couple of tables with chairs and we had a, a display of our project of the, like an introductory to our project uh, to the community we had some very uh, interactive audience they listen to what we have want to say the students themselves introduced what they are doing and like ask the people over there to contribute to participate It was the first time for them to um, to have anyone on their in their area in the street doing any kind of survey. So having students on the on the street is a, an added uh, thing, and introducing a new concept or uh, triggering that eco citizen is not about being just green. It is about uh, how you consume the, your resources, and this is a real um, priority to the people over there. By the end of the project, I mean, we intend or we hope to achieve some sort of proposal perhaps to how to improve your consumption as an individual. Even what can an individual do to improve um, being more green or being more uh, eco city? And what can a CBO uh, contribute to that? And what is the role of the government in that? What are the short term? solutions, what are the long-term solutions. So this is like the, our goal of this uh, three-month three project up to now. I was fortunate actually to work with such a group of uh, different, having different uh, backgrounds, different expertise, learning a lot of, from them, trying to contribute in this sense. Uh, and I hope we can uh, continue on working and actually achieving something that only started like an idea and can be become something tangible. Thank you.